Hey all my renaissance men and women, welcome back to the channel. Today's video is jam-packed. We are heading to the islands of Hawaii. We're going to go over everything from a little bit about the uh, fires in Hawaii, the recent fires. We got a couple Sasquatch encounters we're going to share. We're going to talk about giants. We're going to talk about the mini huni and all kinds of uh, different things from Hawaii. We're going to call up a Hawaii local. He's going to tell us his Sasquatch encounter as well as uh, a bit about the fires, what he's seen and knows about those. Right now we're going to pick up the phone here and we're going to call one of my subscribers. He's going to tell us firsthand about the story and we're going to talk about uh, just whatever. We're just off the record here, live for you guys. So let's give a call to Gabriel. Gabriel? Yep. Renaissance man here. How you doing? What's up, Paul? What's going on? Do you mind if I record, if I push record? And... No, record it, record it, yeah, all good. Um, do you live on the island now, I take it, on Hawaii? I live on a big island, yeah. Yeah. So part of this video, I'm going to do a quick bit about the fires and stuff. I don't know if you want to talk about that at all first or anything. or. Well, I'm down, whatever you want, whatever <clears> you want, bro. My whole theory on the fires, I'm not from there, obviously. I've never been to Hawaii in my life, but everything that I've watched, <clears throat> it seems like it's a direct energy weapon type of fires, and they were targeted attack on the land for a land grab. Um, Absolutely. So, like, I, I think already, like, Oprah and uh, fucking, like, Mark Zuckerberg and them, they already bought up a bunch of that land that burned down and stuff. Um how do you feel about that kind of stuff? And the missing children, that's a whole other thing that I hear is connected well, Oprah, with Oprah Winfrey. Yeah, Oprah, Oprah and The Rock, they're in on that. And um, if you watch these videos and shit, is um, they talk about these pizza parties and this shit and this and that. And these fuckers are child sacrificing scumbags. Zuckerberg's building a new place in Kauai. Yeah. You know, and um, it's not a Maui, but Oprah's doing land grabs. And, um, you know, there is a bunch of missing children. It's just, it's just fucking sad. And normally on the islands, so this one, on the big island, there's been two missing kids in the last fucking 25 years. Yeah. And one of the parents murdered them. And so this is huge for over here. In the like, past 25 years, yeah. In that one yeah, fire, 2,000 2, kids 2. went missing. So do you yeah, think that's so. connected with that whole adrenochrome thing? Because we all know Oprah's into that kind of... Absolutely, yeah. absolutely, absolutely. And I say, you know, but between me and you, I think, you know, that's, um, it's just, you know, these global elites that satanic fucking child sacrifice fuckers that are drinking this fucking blood is what's going on. And then the two, you know, whatever, and, you know, you, everything's coming to pass and happening right now across the nation, you know what I mean? And so that was a trip. But, you know, what was crazy thing is, is there was two of these other fucking energy things that came down over here. One was in one on the big island. Yeah. It would happen the same time the Maui would happen. But it rained so much on my side that it's a fucking rainforest, dude. So, you know, it, it burned out. And the Kahala side was like, there wasn't even shit that they could burn. But that's definitely an energy weapon that came from upstairs and uh, or from up, you know, in the, whether it was a satellite or whatever. And there was guys that got videos of it. And then on top of that, the fucking stupid scumbag governor and Helco and everybody, you know, they left the fucking... Um, you know, the power on, they cut the water off, you know. Yeah, and, I heard um, that. They cut the water yeah, off to everybody beforehand. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, and then Josh Green, the governor, you know, he's done stand-up shit. You know BJ Penn, the MMA fighter? Yeah, right? yeah, I know BJ Penn. Yeah, yeah. so he, he's went and stood up against them. And, you know, there's been a lot of Hawaiians that are standing up against the whole situation. But, you know, now, they're, they're, the, you know, the globalists are kind of backing down on it. But, um, yeah, there's, you know... Um, I don't even know what to say because it's just it's just fucking so sad and um you know the evil that's happening in the world right now is just it's dude it's just you can't even fathom it it's just it's nuts you know and uh you know I'm, I'm a hardcore just you know every day I go to play fights for 20 30 times a day to get me by shit you know but um at the same time you know I got my own little issues you know I'm you know I'm a party animal and shit too 
you know, whatever, but, uh, yeah. you know, so, you know. That's cool. We got um, the same views on that whole story then. So, like, that's pretty crazy. Some of the cars and stuff were melted right to right to a liquid, right next to, like, other things that weren't even touched by the fire. Like, trees are still standing, and homes are just destroyed. And also the crazy thing was with all the houses were painted blue. Yeah, yeah. There's That's something about the direct energy weapon. The rich people had the blue roof, and they didn't get touched by the laser beams. Yeah. Fucked up. Hey, I'll give you the interview right now because I talk to you in a minute. But, uh, yeah, but, um, yeah, no, straight up. And so, yeah, that's the crazy thing. And then everybody, there's a realtor guy over there that he's been on it. And he's on YouTube and shit, too. But, you know, they've been just exposed and shit. And so right now it's just like, you know, Oprah speaks with a fork and tongue. You know what I mean? She's a fucking snake. I'm Native American. I don't know. My, my father's a Havasu Native American. My mother's from Idaho. Yeah. I'm a, you know, I'm half native, but um, uh, I moved to Hawaii in um, 1988. You know, but uh, anyway, um, what's your native background? Yeah. Uh, I have a suit. I have a suit native Mojave Indian. Mojave. Yeah, Mojave Indian. How old are you? Can I ask? How How old are you? Fifty years old. I'm 50, Fifty. years old. Cool. You got yeah, ten I've years on me. Contractor for the last thirty years over here, and then uh, but I lost my leg. Um. I got your number and I'll save you. I'll send you a bunch of pictures after. But yeah, I lost my leg a year and a half ago. Oh, wow. That and was you know, recent. Just, um, yeah, so I'm just training, trying to get back in shape again with a prosthetic leg. Uh, How's the prosthetic training going? Uh, it's fucking tough, dude. But I'm, I'm, getting, I'm getting it down. Do you got like one of those little yeah. spring feet type of things or that you can like run and stuff? Yeah, it's a, I got the athletic one. The fucking thing's like 14 grand. Ooh. Uh, it's, just, it's just not. It's, it's, uh, God's foot's way better. <laughs> Yeah, so, I'm sure once you run around on it for a few years, you'll be probably just, may, might even be better than a normal leg. <laughs> uh, I doubt that, but anyway, you know what? It is what it is, bro. What are you doing, you know? Yeah, sorry to hear that, man. But, uh, you no, still good, still getting out in the forest and stuff? and. Oh, hell yeah. Well, Here's the deal. There's been giants in Hawaii from day one. Oh, yeah. Hawaiian times. I got a bunch you know, of footage and, um, of that, the petrified giants that are all over the mountains and stuff. Yeah, not only that, but there was like, you know, like in the 70s and shit, there was sightings all over Oahu and over here in Maui. It's like, dude, they're here. Like, these forests are so fucking big over here, bro. Like, the big island is fucking huge. Everybody makes like a small, and they think we live in little grass huts. These yeah. forests over here are so fucking deep. No man, there's so much areas where no man has stepped. It's fucking crazy. It's like... The area where I got chased out, and you know, I didn't even know what, what it, but until I started, when I lost my leg, I started studying all this shit, and then also I was, I've, I've, I've hunted every single state from the Rockies to the left, in the western state, I've hunted Alaska, I've hunted fucking Washington, Oregon, California, Nevada, um, Colorado, Arizona, I they didn't hunt New Mexico, but I hunted, you know, I know, I've hunted all those states, and um, I've had deer taken from me, you know, I've had choke encounters of all kinds of shit, but what happened over here was what I, I thought it was, um, I didn't know what it was, it was more paranormal, but what happened was I went in to go look for my, just, shall I tell you now? Or yeah, yeah, I know you right. kind of know the story, but I, um, from my, my, my mouth, you're going to hear way better. Yeah, for sure. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Are you recording? Yeah, we're recording. 